going on youtubers after sound back right now doing a review on galaxy s3 and this is your first jelly bean my ui rom so let's go ahead and get to the review now i'm gonna start from the home screen or lock screen sorry so on the lock screen if you are at night walking around on the sideway or sidewalk and you can press home button keep pressing it turns into plus light that's the first feature I'm gonna mention typical my UI lock screen as you can see if you have noticed or if you have flashed the ROM before you notice that it's typical with four options call text and picture or camera press agree when you first boot in you won't have any data your soft light or soft keys buttons will lights will not be up but if you wait you might get signal but won't get 4G second thing you will need to do is touch around the brightness and your buttons will light up then just simply press power button reboot okay let your phone reboot which will get you your 4G working once that is done you will have your my you are running properly with 4G connection and everything else working please keep in mind this is just a beta version so it might have a couple of issues this is not the final version yet or this is not something to consider this is just something that it thinks stable enough to run as a daily run so as you can that see that is working this is your home screen my UI is kind of like iPhone you uh, and uh, all the Apple fanboys you might be happy that there is one ROM in Android that supports Apple launcher aka no launcher at all so this is it this is the launcher and this is the uh, those, uh, these are the app it comes with pull down menu toggles these are the toggles oops you cannot even see it because it's so white let me lower down that okay these are the toggles and as you can see softly turn it on just because of that notification area I'm gonna go and press on that and disable it go into setting and full setting about phone here you can see what you're running now I'm gonna go into Wi-Fi turn it on put in my password connect it says authenticating and it's connected now as you can see Wi-Fi works uh, now we are going to get started with the ROM review display setting here you can change your brightness wallpapers get a good wallpapers going Lock screen wallpaper again. MIUI has good wallpapers, and you can choose different lock screen from right there. Just download whichever one you like. I don't know why I'm taking this long, but here you go download and apply.
there you go it's already set up as a lock screen and go back I'm gonna have to keep it like that so the white won't bother my camera there you can set up that launcher and here's your launcher setting effect of uh, transactions crossfire by theme 4x4 four four and all that font size auto rotation sleep we can put it as much you want and sound setting you can change your sound in there basic status bar setting here is the customization comes in page right now your toggles look like this if you choose that now your toggles will look differently like that which I don't like so I'm gonna have that here on second part you can change the position of the throw around throw around and you can see everything got changed up so that's your position collapsed when clicked that works uh, customize status by notification how no, all the notification is displayed uh, expand uh, the unlock screen show traffic info if you want that security and privacy lock screen just like regular now LED setting is uh, really important because for notification you can set up different colors I'm gonna set it to red calls green messages blue you see that on oh my bad you weren't seeing the LED let's go calls red blue red green as you can see LED changes color so there you can set up different colors for all three messaging or notification then all the apps here are customized already that's your regular calling apps 644 I don't know what that is for that's how it looks and that's my locks and lock paper yeah my call not be completed that's fine this is your context so white we're going to go ahead and change the theme of this room to something we can work with online so this is a really good one download or downloading until that downloads we're gonna go to this apply and it's gonna be starting up oh it's already applied now let's go ahead and see it you'll be surprised that you have not seen this with AOKP or CM9 check out the lock screen if you got a message see that that's how you unlock and get into message app that's how you get into call for clock and this is how you unlock this lock phone really great right and that's how the theme looks regular and until it gets down it has Google Pro now has its own calendar application see nice notes everything themed out for MIUI special email just waiting for this to finish downloading it's not even one percent what you kidding me I don't know why my internet is acting out right now but as you can see you can have different 
themes then under here you have all your applications just like that another important thing is when you press back button that's what comes on that's your multitasking you can press that and it swipes everything out that's your power menu volume those lights came again and under tools you have those tools that's clock compass touch or torch sorry recording music I don't want to get busted for the copyright so I'm going to have it down but once it's playing the music lock screen appears on the regular lock screen and that was themed one that's why it didn't appear and you can change out songs and stuff and this was a review of MIUI or my UI ROM Jelly Bean for your Galaxy S3 AT&T I'll have a link in description for other Galaxy S3s thank you for watching guys go ahead and go subscribe at androidtechblogspot.com or check that out subscribe tech 989 address on and I'll see you later